Jack is an exceptional person. Um, they are a community leader and advocate. And really what has stood out for me is their openness and respect for people and their willingness to build bridges. They just, their work never stops, um, I think is, is the biggest thing. This drive and this vision that they have uh, keeps them uh, pushing to make the world a better place and, and pushing to do that in tangible and material ways. So I think just going to university really helped me grow and, and expand my horizons in a lot of ways. Um, but I think that the thing that's impacted me the most is really the people that I've met. Um, you know, the professors that I've built relationships with who have continued to be professional mentors for me. They have been requested by numerous different organizations to chair uh, particularly difficult meetings or AGMs. Um, they've served on numerous different boards and founded nonprofit organizations themselves. Jack is deserving of this award because they are an outstanding and exceptional community leader and advocate. Uh, they have worked tirelessly at UR Pride, um, both working with you know, uh, people on campus as well as in the community, uh, and have really been very creative in trying to seek out what programming needs exist, both again within the university and broader community. That drive and that vision uh, really speaks to just their passion for trying to make the world a better place, um, especially for queer and trans people, but for everybody and taking a really intersectional lens to that. Receiving this alumni award, um, I think means a lot in that I am one of the first people to criticize the university or to challenge them when they make when I, when they make what I perceive to be mistakes. And so being recognized by an institution that I often challenge to do better and who, you know, there are there are enough tweets from me uh, towards the university to probably fill a fill a large room. So um, yeah, I think being recognized by an institution that um, that I regularly challenge is really cool. And and to me, that's really. Um, that's really what makes the University of Regina special is that it's uh, is that it's willing to listen to that feedback um, and it recognizes the importance of having people push back against it because there's no way to really improve unless you have people challenging you. Um, and so to be to be celebrated by by an institution that I push back against a lot uh, is really humbling.